Oh, I've already started eating gears in the engine here. Totally living my dream. And Matt, I have brought along some friends. Actually, I didn't bring them along. Our chef created, built me some friends. I want to see if you recognize this guy right here chugging along towards Christmas with me. You know who he is? Ah, ah, the name is at the tip of my tongue. I remember uh, he's from all the Christmas cartoon movies. Uh, Cornelius? Cornelius! Yes! Good job! <laughs> Photographer Mike Crotchy is really excited. <laughs> you knew who he was. He knew you would. So we've got a lot of new additions to this incredible edible train chugging us closer to Christmas. And that is uh, Cornelius, as you saw. But we've got the back of the train filled with presents. And you know when you have this many gifts? We tell you about porch pirates. Well, we don't want any train pirates. So we have the ultimate security guard, the abominable snowman. Bigger than, I mean, anything I've ever seen. And uh, I'm here with uh, Chef Mark Slesser. And Chef, it, it, you just keep making it bigger. Every single year I come here and I think, well, it can't get bigger and better than this. But you do it every year. I, w w what brought or inspired this? Um, we, we wanted a classic feel that really would bring not only the older generations, but the younger. And uh, the Abominable was probably one of my favorites as a child in, in Rudolph and Sam Snowman in Yukon. And so I made them all out of sugar. Uh, this guy is about 350 pounds of just powdered sugar alone. Oh my so, gosh, where do you even get that much powdered sugar? Uh, special order. Yeah, I, I, I would imagine, <laughs> I would imagine. Have you had many people trying to eat him yet? Um, they, Rudolph's ear, they took a little piece of him off, but oh. other than that, uh, we're, we've been, it's, it's held up really well this year. So. Nibbling on Rudolph, Rudolph's a survivor <clears throat> though, and he's, uh, he's still yeah. leading the way. <laughs> Well, this is such a cool thing, and you have uh, brought along, and not only is this something that people can come and see, but once you're here, there are several ways that you can participate in the Royal Park Hotel's campaign to help out the Salvation Army. Um, yeah, and Major, yeah. Come, come on around, and you can kind sure. of scoot around closer to me. One of the ways is buying mittens. The other way is diving into these delectable desserts. Great. For those of you who don't know, who haven't heard me say it before, um, Chef Mark Slesser is really a gem here in Rochester. He is an award-winning winning pastry chef and when I say award winning not just in the county but really throughout the country so so lucky to have you um, and I, I don't know if you guys can see this they're telling me only have 30 seconds left which does not make sense this just time just went by too fast but check this out I've been eating this chocolate dessert right there look at that mousse inside where I've already been eating in between the breaks because I get hungry and how can you stop um, you've got some new desserts though I do want to touch in real quick um, this looks different pumpkin gingerbread cheesecake so we always want to find a way to incorporate gingerbread so people can actually taste what the train actually is like and so but the pumpkin's ah. like the perfect blend mm -mm. it's so creamy and then uh, we have the beignets which have been popular since we opened chocolate cake the bourbon butter pecan and the creme brulee the creme brulee yeah i love it these um these uh, he has to like there has to be guards to keep me away from these beignets because every single year i say they're they're addictive they are so good <laughs> not too sweet um but really amazing and you make this all the sauces you the make all chutney, the sauces the the raspberry and the, the chocolate Okay. Well, he, he has been keeping me away from the gingerbread train, but as I toss that back to Matt there in the studio, I'm going to give this so I can taste a little bit of the gingerbread, this incredible dessert. Again, Royal Park Hotel in Rochester. Back to you, Matt. Mm.